Congratulations on earning this assignment, Commander. I am Captain Georgi Kukov, Chief of Field Operations for this region. Beyond this river lies Germany. Tomorrow our attack begins. For today, you have guard duty. See to it that nothing happens to the base or to the command center. The Allies have been moving closer and closer to our position. Watch out for sneak attacks. If conflict erupts, you have permission to take the fight to them. See you in Berlin. Hello everyone and welcome to Command and Conquer Blue Alert. I'm here with Tax Albert, the creator of this co-op campaign version of the Soviet campaign of Red Alert 1. Welcome back everyone. Welcome to the second mission for the Soviets. This time we have to guard our base here, even though, well, the actual goal is to take out all Allied forces. Yes, I thought it was an interesting briefing. Like, defend the base! But take them out anyway. <laughs> That's very true. It's got a oh, kennel. I notice. Yeah, I just noticed I get the Soviet uh, discount on all structures, the fifteen percent. That's nice. Interesting. Yeah, you do get that during the original campaign because you play as as the Soviets, and they get that multiplayer discount. Fair enough. Time to spam dogs. Probably should build a refinery before I do that though, because that'll be a very short video that otherwise. might be useful, yeah. <laughs> Generally speaking. Get another barracks here. A dog's any good for scouting. Yes, they can report home everything they see. They have a brilliant sight range. That's good, because technicians cannot do that. Now, apparently, even though this is on our border, it's still a church, so we can still destroy it. That is true. But I suppose that's a Polish-German border, so this is... Well, now it's the Soviet Union. Mm. But before that it wasn't. No crate in there. Well, that's disappointing. Yes. Disappointing indeed. Well, that's okay. Unfortunately, planes can't... Can't report home. No. I think they would be good for scouting, but no, they're, they're not. Yes, <laughs> foolish and me, I thought, you know, oh, a dog could give vision, surely a plane can, no, no. <laughs> yeah, get, get your facts straight, yeah. Oh, that, that guy's just got wrecked. Yeah, that, that bridge is certainly gone. Time to take out... Oh, I have a truck! Yeah, destroy it. Not the truck. Oh, he has a crate. I'm trying to run over your force. Oh, there we go. Oh, it gives me no vision. Excellent. <laughs> it reshrouded my map. <laughs> really, it did? Yes. Oh, dear. Uh, actually, so, so, the, so this might be a side effect of this being a technically multiplayer map, but that, that is interesting. I did not expect that. This is supposed to be a money crate, but maybe you can't actually designate those as. But I think we had money crates in previous missions. Oh, here's a regular, a random crate here. Maybe we accidentally turned on random crates. This one's funny, is very possible, yeah. <laughs> okay, so, the, where did, oh, oh, I guess we did turn on random crates, because otherwise there should not be a crate there. Mm. Well, you, you can do that optionally. It's, it's definitely a thing you can do. Yeah, it's turn on power bombs now, and other so, things like that. Yeah, you, you could actually get like an MCV or maybe like a mammoth tank or so. It's slightly Anything could happen that, but... Yeah. But the eye can can do the same though, even though they only walk over crates accidentally. But all bets are off now. Mm. It's gonna send my yak to go and kill this one rifle. I'll go for this one yep. turret here. But there's another church, so there's there's a second chance to get something useful. Let's see. There should be enough dogs. Yeah. Is it though? 
Is, is it really enough dogs? Hard to say. There we are. Yeah, the allies are not, not up too much. But that's not too surprising. It's only the second mission. Oh, they actually shot down my plane there. That wasn't very nice, was it? That's rude. Yeah, I can but see you have to face the most dangerous of units, is. the ore miner. Mm. They start yakking away at things. Good, good, good. We'll get some more riflemen over here. Got nice. <laughs> Got reinforcements, allegedly. Yep, oh, those were critical barrels. Yes, Lots of grenadiers. Yes, oh, I'll help. Yes, yes, good, good, good. Take well. yes, out this construction once. yard here. Yeah, riflemen actually yes, have a pretty decent yes, ratio of money to firepower. Hmm. If you compare a mammoth tank, which costs I think 1,500 credits, to 15 riflemen, 15 riflemen have way more firepower. I mean, even in a world where that's the case, what keeps the mammoth being practical versus just the heavy tank is this regen, right? So. That's true. What they really should do is just mount 15 rifles on a mammoth tank, which is the mm. Battle Fortress. Oh yeah, I guess suppose that is better for it. Oh, oh. To the, the ore miner's coming for us. Uh, on the warpath. No. Oh, we took the fight to them, alright. That is very true. Thanks for watching and see you next time.